The K2 Process Portal is a SharePoint-based site that provides process administrators and users with a full view of information and reports about their deployed K2 processes. The Process Portal site can be created anywhere within your SharePoint environment and is configurable so that you can decide which processes you want to include and what information you would like to show. One of the ways in which you can use K2 Process Portal information is to see errors as they happen. No matter how well you've planned your processes, errors can happen at any time, so it's important to have a way to quickly find those errors and be able to fix them with as little disruption as possible. The K2 Process Portal information shows you a summary of the status of each process so you can see when a process is in error state, like we see here with the customer onboarding process. Drilling into the process instance information, we can see that the error is occurring on Leon's Garden Services and Supplies. Clicking on the View Flow icon will open a graphical view of the process so we can see exactly where the error is occurring. It looks like the error is occurring on the first step of the process, at the Bad Debt Ratio check, so let's take a look at the error logs to see what's going on. The error log indicates that the problem is with a missing file. We know that this step uses an Excel spreadsheet file to retrieve some information, so let's take a look at that file to see if we can find the problem. The bad debt ratio file is normally located in the shared documents library on our site. Navigating to that library, we can see that the file is still there. However, it looks like someone has renamed the file with updated. Since our process was configured to look for a file with a different name, that's probably what is causing the error. Checking the properties on the file, we see that the name has been updated. We want to change the name of the file back to the original name, but we'll update the title of the document to indicate that it has been updated recently. Now we can go back to the Instance Management page and retry the process. The error appears to have gone away, so let's take a look at the K2 view flow to verify that the process has gotten past the error. The view flow indicates that the process instance is now waiting for Sales Manager approval, so we have successfully resolved the error.